So welcome ladies and gentlemen, welcome to today's video. We are going to be going over the newest update, right? This is for you guys over on eFootball Universe. If you are a member, you've got the new update on its way and I'm going to go over that very, very quickly, showcase a few screenshots, show you guys what we've been working on. Uh, and then the good news is next week, Master League will officially just continue. I'm going to record today get a bunch of games going, uh, and then next week you guys will be able to tune in for some more madness because, honestly, these Master League episodes are getting more mental each episode, to be honest, but it's all good fun. So let's dive into this. So over the last few months, we've been working on the brand new update, um, and we're going to go through that pretty much of what we're going to be doing because there's only a couple of leagues done right now. And before we get into this, no, we will not be. Sh I will. We will not be putting this out free. Okay, you do have to be a member on eFootball Universe to download the file. There is a thing called hosting and other fees that we have to pay and maintain this website. So that's why we charge a very small. Okay, it is literally ten dollars for the year. That's under a dollar a month, folks. And people buy coffees for five, ten dollars, no problem. So yeah, if you do want the file. Please do support us because we really do appreciate it. And if you don't want it, then that's fine. You can always get it later. Uh, but anyway, let's dive into it. So the new season begins. I'll zoom in a little bit on this. Uh, and version one kicks off uh, another year of content with PES 21. Uh, version one begins in early access beta, right? So that's what it is. Remember, the transfers are not completely finished yet. We still have a little bit of time. Uh, with two leagues fully updated uh, with a complete overhaul of squads, 23-24 summer transfers, new wonder kids created from scratch, uh, and 200 plus player upgrades, downgrades, uh, as well as new formations and tactics for the top teams. So we haven't just done the transfers, folks. We are obviously going in there and updating what needs to be updated. If there's certain players that you think need a boost or we think need a boost, someone like Ganacho, obviously a Pez 21 Ganacho is going to be pretty poor. Now, he's obviously established, him, established himself as a pretty good player. So we up the stats. Uh, players have also been given new skills specific to their roles within the squads, as well as more accurate play styles, fluid formations, skills, and motion styles. Uh, a new league will be added. Now, this is what you need to take note of, because yes, we're only doing the opening two leagues to start with, as it is a beta, uh, but a new league will be added per week until September 1st, uh, with a final update coming once the transfer window closes uh, and the squads are finalized in real life. Uh, please give any feedback for version 2. Uh, player physiques and hairstyles have also been tweaked on created players. Uh, and a massive, massive shout out to Carrasco, Alistair, um, Nono, JP Kitts uh, and Ariel Edson that have been doing all the goodness. So yes, this isn't a file that you're going to download today or whenever we release it. I think it is coming out today, um, but we're going to keep updating this weekly. So whether you want to start a Master League or not, you might want to wait a little bit. You could always start one and then restart one afterwards if you want to do a quick sesh. Uh, but because the transfers aren't complete, you know, this is the best way to do it. Every single week we'll begin updating, you know, the different leagues. Um, but for, to start with, I believe it is going to be the, the top two leagues to start with Premier League for sure and I think La Liga due to you know Bellingham being there but I'll confirm that so anyway that is what we're looking at couple of screenshots but I will show you guys now some screenshots all right so just going over you know obviously it's going to look better in game right and remember this is running off of Pez 21 so you can only do so much also take note folks regarding Arsenal and Manchester United they are licensed in this game, so we can't change their first, second, or third kit. We can only add a fourth kit. So we're going to be adding the new United home, I believe, the new United, um, the new Arsenal away. Really nothing we can do about that, unfortunately. It's just due to licensing issues, uh, and it is what it is. So we're going to run through. There is just, you know, a couple of screenshots for you guys to take a look at. There are the kits. There are the players' faces. You've got the likes of uh, Everton there, uh, Jude Bellingham looking the part. I mean, he's certainly a good player, isn't he? 
Uh, Andre Gomez, we've got two of him. So of Everton, there we go. Uh, Kund uh, Gundogan, of course, has gone to Barcelona after his Man City days. And there is uh, a look of the lads coming out. Uh, McAllister, of course, from Liverpool. But look, I've actually gone back. There's Milner, the old. Um, he's got su he's got such a defined chin. Um, I always go back. I do like to play. You know, I've been trying out the, the you know the file here and there, and uh, you know, it is good fun when you haven't played for a while and you want to just go back and play with the updated lineups and teams, and especially with a brand new season, it is nice and refreshing. So. Yeah, it is uh, It's certainly worthwhile. If you haven't played PES 21 in a while, folks, now's your time. Go and get it. Download it. Whatever you need to do. There is Tonali of Newcastle. Uh, Vinicius there and Kunde in the uh, La Liga. So, yeah, it's going to be the Premier League fully updated along with La Liga uh, for the current time. And there is Sterling of the Chelsea. So there we have it, folks. That's pretty much it for today. Nothing crazy, but I wanted to showcase that this file is ready to roll. We're going to keep updating it, so make sure you leave your feedback as well because we do take note of that. Um, and yes, it will be available on PS4, PS5, and PC. If you have an Xbox, there's just nothing we can do because unfortunately that's the way it is. Um, yes, I've, I've never understood why... Xbox never enabled you to be able to import stuff from USBs because, you know, you, you'd have a, another market there for you, you know? But anyway, we'll be back shortly. As I mentioned, Master League will continue 100% next week. We'll be bashing that out, having some good fun stuff. Uh, but yeah, if you want to support this website, us as a whole, just head over to the PlayStation Plus membership uh, and right there is where you can become a member. Um, and, you know... It, we haven't changed the price. It's still hardly anything. And we are going to be updating this throughout the course of the year. We're still waiting for eFootball, of course, with Master League and what exactly is happening there. Um, but yeah, until next time, subscribe for more. Keep an eye on this. And we will be back very, very shortly. Take care.